This example is a little bit more complex. We have 1764 divided by 3465, and I want to simplify it. I have previously factored. That's my denominator, 3 times 3 times 5 times 7 times 11. And for students' benefits, you probably should go ahead and, and show them the factorization and how you do it. And there's the factorization of 1764. So then I can match up the pieces that cancel. There's a 3. There's a 7. And, oh look, there's another three. This one with this one. That is a mess. Let me do that other one in a different color. Notice the use of colors here. So those match, and all the other ones match like so. So we have two times two times seven on the top, and five times 11 on the bottom. So we're left with 28 over 55. Again, taking each one of these and saying, okay, I'm going to divide 3 into this one and 3 into this one and reduce that way is going to be a lot more of a pain than just stretching it out with the factorization and seeing how nice it can work.